Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay, I came across this video that totally freaked me out because it was like a direct confirmation from God of something that I shared with you guys a few days ago. And I'm about to show you. So watch this clip really quick. It's about three minutes, but please listen to her message carefully, okay? And when that clip is done, I'm going to come back here and talk about it with you guys. Hi, everyone. Lots of listens and love. Hope you guys are doing well. Did you guys have a good day today? All right. So I was going to do a different message, but this was placed into my spirit, right? Some people needed to learn some things throughout this life. And we all do. But let me tap into what I'm trying to tell you. There's a lot of things that God do that you don't have a clue about you don't understand what is happening right <clears throat> a lot of people came across you throughout their life they didn't know how to treat you and as a result god removed you out of their hands right there are people and this is a mixture of message it will connect to the people there are people that even try to put specific things on you sorcery or whatever they call it witchcraft voodoo etc and what they didn't understand was that they wasn't supposed to touch you at all, right? When I said, and when I said they wasn't supposed to, take it seriously what I'm telling you. They wasn't supposed to mess with you at all where that is concerned. You understand me? Hmm. Now just be used as a vest as I'm speaking to you guys, right? <clears throat> Sorry, I think I had a booger. Right? So god needed people to learn some things because let me tell you something there's some people throughout this life that when you try certain things with them it can even get to a point of god laying people to rest mm -hmm. laying people to rest as in he has no choice but to take them out right so you need to understand that even though a lot of things not gonna make sense to you because God don't play. Listen to me carefully. A lot of things don't make sense to you as to what God is doing. But God needed people to learn some lessons in this life. And I know it sounds messed up. But a lot of you guys are picked to teach them a lesson. You are picked to teach them a lesson. Right? They had you. They play a lot of games and they do a lot of stuff. And then God do what God got to do. And then people sit down some days when it start to make sense and tears start to flow and it start to hit them real bad. Right? All I got to say is let God be God. Everything is not going to make sense to you. All right? God needed to teach people that listen to me. Don't do certain things. Because if that's the path you choose, that is what he's going to do. Right? He used you to teach them. Who not to come after. Who not to toss to the curb. Who not to step up on, etc. And who not to be used. God bless you. Did you guys hear that? Did you guys freaking hear that? Because I know I am not crazy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Sorry, my eye itches. I am a... Oof. Ooh, ooh. I am mind blown right now. Did I not, and please go back because you will see it, but did I not share with you guys the other day, not only on my community wall, but on a video that God showed me a vision that these people mocking God are in big trouble if they don't repent, okay? The vision that I got was so bad that I didn't want to uh, even share it or speak into it because it's, it's sad. But literally, <sighs> literally the vision that I got is and, and the message that I got from God was the same thing that this lady just shared here on this video clip that I showed you guys. I, I'm sorry, I am mind blown again because God will always confirm his word to you. 
So if you are doubting that you are hearing from God or you're wondering, am I just going crazy? No, you're not because God will always find a way to confirm his word to you multiple times, not once, not twice, sometimes as many times as he has to just so that you could get it through your head. You are not crazy. You are hearing from me and I am the one guiding you. I've been telling you guys for a while that God has been showing me this and this woman just confirmed it, okay? People have been trying witchcraft, sorcery, voodoo, everything, and it doesn't work. It doesn't work because God's protection is over me. And that is exactly what this woman has just spoken. That is exactly what God showed me, but I didn't want to be so morbid to get on here and be like, because I didn't want it to sound like a threat. So I was like, ooh, I got to use my words wisely because people, especially haters, are going to take this the wrong way and think that I am threatening them in some way, shape, or form. And God said, no, my wrath will fall upon them if they do not repent because God cannot be mocked. Another thing he told me was, touch not my anointed. Okay, if God, first of all, don't mess with the children of God. Okay, I am a child of the most high God. Are you wondering if you have tried to hurt me in any way, shape, or form? Are you wondering why your sorcery, voodoo, and witchcraft is not working on me? It is because I serve the almighty powerful God, more powerful than the devil that you serve, okay? And the way that God has just confirmed his word to me, it just shows you how true God is. Don't mess with his children, okay? But that is legit what I saw in my vision, and I was so scared to share it because I was terrified for that person. And it's more than one person. It's a group of people. I've told you again. I've told you before in my last video, and I will tell you again, is a group of people, and God showed me. And this lady that I just duetted with, that I showed you, she confirmed the word. And she said, sometimes God has no other choice but to take those people out, okay? Because they will not repent and all they do is mock God. When I say take out, yes, I legit mean that that person is going to, okay? That person is going to croak. And if they don't repent before they go, y'all already know where they're going. Y'all already know where they, whether you believe in heaven and hell or not, that is not God's problem. It's still real. It still exists. Just like there is good, there is evil. And once again, God cannot be mocked. So here's the confirmation of the word that I gave you guys a few days ago. And God wanted me to see that video. I came across that video because God needed to confirm it to me. Because one of my friends told me, she came privately to me and she told me, Monica, you have no idea how much your videos are helping people. So don't doubt yourself and don't think that you're crazy. Now, if the haters are talking and saying anything, I wouldn't know because honestly, I don't watch anybody that I've had beef with in the past. I don't watch them at all. So I have no idea what they're doing or saying about me. And my friends have come to the understanding that I no longer want to hear about it, so they won't tell me either. They finally got it through their head that I am not taking any part of any drama whatsoever. And I really don't care what the haters are saying because at the end of the day, I know that God is handling it. I took my hands off it a long time ago, and I know that God is doing justice. And God has just showed me and confirmed his word once again that he is redeeming us, vindicating us for everything that the evil people have put us through. God is just and he vindicates. So know this, you guys, I like I told you in that one video, all we can do is pray for those people, okay? Pray that they repent and change their ways. But unfortunately, from what I am hearing and seeing as confirmation, um, doesn't seem like that is happening. So therefore, we already know what their end will be. So, you know, may God have mercy on them. But I just, you know, I needed to get on here real quick and share this with you guys. Because when I saw this video uh, flipping through TikTok, I was... I was in shock. I was I was mind blown because like God will never fail. God will always confirm his word 
to you and that's how you will know that you're not crazy and it's just your mind or whatever or any crazy ideas that you may think are popping up in your head no sometimes it re you really are hearing from god and he will always there is no doubt about it he will always confirm his word so once again touch not the anointed of god because it will not go well for you my visions rarely fail me when i have dreams and visions and god speaks to me it always comes to pass so i really feel sorry for those people out there who are just so their mission in life is to do evil no matter what their mission is to be relentless in this because they are so miserable deep down inside they are consumed by hatred bitterness and evil has totally consumed them to the point where the person is no longer the person like evil has just completely overtaken them and all we can do is pray for people like that but once again i didn't want to make this video long but i needed to share and confirmation you guys confirmation so for those of you out there who feel like you're going you've gone through hell and injustice and you feel like god is not vindicating you or redeeming you hang in there because it's coming hang in there because god's wrath is coming upon those who have put you through hell and we our duty is not to gloat and be happy about it we know their ending is going to be sad and terrible but we cannot gloat all we can do is pray so hang in there guys because trust me you no I was going to say you will be. No, you are already being vindicated and redeemed. Wait for it. You will see the goodness of the Lord. You will see his justice. I've told you guys out there many times, get your hands off it. Don't take revenge upon your own hands. Let God deal with it because nobody does it better than God. So hang in there because us as children of God, the ones who truly are children of God, you know, not the ones that claim his name, take his name in vain, claim Christianity left to right, but are doing evil deeds behind the scenes. Those are not really children of God, but the true children of God, we hear his, we know his voice. God says, the Bible says, my sheep hear my voice and they listen. We know his voice and he always confirms his word to us and he is good so just have peace in that and know that justice is being served you should have never messed with a child of god